Good afternoon, Chicago Bear Tariq Cohen says he and his family appreciate the condolences, thoughts and prayers. He asked for privacy during this time. Raleigh Police and the Wake County Sheriff's Department say Terrell Cohen was electrocuted while trying to climb equipment at a power substation in an effort to get away from officers after a car crash. The Bears running back tweets, I lost my brother, my twin, myself. What a great man he was. I am glad I got to express just how much I loved him while he was here. God truly calls home the best and most worthy. I'll just miss him forever. A Duke Energy employee found the 25 year old's body Sunday inside the perimeter of the substation near Raleigh. Cohen had gotten into a car accident the day before, then disappeared. Raleigh officers and the highway patrol searched for him but could not find him. They resumed the search after the Cohen family filed a missing persons report. In 2017, the Bears drafted Tariq Cohen, who grew up in the Raleigh area and attended North Carolina A&T University. Before his brother was found, he sought help on social media. In tweets that have since been deleted, Cohen asked followers to be on the lookout for Terrell. He shared his brother's last known whereabouts, described what he was wearing, and said he may have been injured. The Bears released this statement. We are heartbroken to learn of the death of Tariq Cohen's brother Terrell. We am, our immediate thoughts and prayers go out to Tariq, his mother, Tawanda, and the rest of their family and loved ones. On behalf of the entire Bears family, we extend our most heartfelt sympathies to all who mourn his loss. Terrell Cohen leaves behind two young daughters. The twins' younger brother was shot nearly two years ago. The shooting left him paralyzed. In the newsroom, Judy Wang, WGN News.